Chromebooks have always been thought of as cheap laptops, running a glorified web browser instead of an operating system, but times have certainly changed. Today, you can buy powerful Chromebooks and use them to run local Android and Linux apps, and now, that's extending to games. Google has officially released Steam for Chrome OS, at least in its alpha state. Alpha means anything can break. Due to the inherent instability of the dev channel and the in-progress nature of this feature, we don't recommend trying this on a Chromebook that you rely on for work, school, or other daily activities. You will encounter crashes, performance regressions, and never-before-seen bugs. Installing Steam for Chrome OS is a bit of a hassle at this moment, as you'll need a compatible high-end and modern Chromebook, as well as the Chrome OS dev channel on configurations of these Chromebooks with Intel Iris Z graphics, 11th Gen Core i5 or i7 processors, and at least 8GB of RAM. Note, configurations of these devices with an i3 CPU or 4GB of RAM are not supported. Once installed, Steam for Chrome OS sits in the app drawer alongside Chrome, system apps, Android apps, and web apps. But when it boots up, it's the same native app that you'd find on other platforms. Installing Steam doesn't require to turn on Linux support in the settings menu, which hints that this might be a little more user-friendly than the existing Linux app integration. After you've gone through the installation process, though, you should be ready to test out Steam and the games that come with it. Google has a list of which ones it recommends trying out, some of which have a few caveats. Google says Steam on Chrome OS will typically run the Linux version of a game, but it also says that Proton, a compatibility layer for running Windows games, is supported as well. That's a welcome surprise, though it does make sense given how much effort Valve's put into the Linux gaming experience in an effort to make its Steam Deck console as capable as possible. John Maladies, a Chrome OS VP, even cites Valve's deep investment in the Linux ecosystem when talking about how Google worked with the company to get Steam working on Chrome OS. Steam has been a long time coming to Chromebooks. Google announced it in January 2020 and didn't say much else about it after that until last week. And given the number of warnings Google is giving people about the alpha, it says anything can break and that you will encounter crashes, performance regressions, and never-before-seen bugs while testing it. It can be a while before it's a good idea to put it on your main Chromebook. This alpha test state works on barely half a dozen machines and requires some slightly advanced software tweaks to run. Even if you have a compatible machine, it's not necessarily something we'd recommend rushing to install. In time, the list of supported devices will surely expand.